are not speeding. Yeah, so this is an effort to save tens of thousands of lives every year. The NTSB is calling on the federal government to make this change. The board wants lawmakers to offer car makers incentives for putting what's called smart speed limiter systems in the new vehicles. So the system knows the speed limit and will not let you go above it. New York City is trying it out in some of its city vehicles. It feels kind of intrusive and invasive. I think from a regulatory standpoint, I think it might be overstepping some bounds. I think the average consumer is going to see this as an overreach by the government. That's what the people are saying. So keep in mind the system does have an override. It'll let you drive a little faster for 15 seconds. That's when you hit the button. So you got to be able to hit the button, which provides another step. You and I were talking earlier and saying, what if you need to speed up to get out of the way? Right, because some, you know, sometimes it's brake and sometimes it's, you know, yeah, put, put the pedal down. You uh -huh. don't mess around with those 18 wheelers, Angela. Well, and yeah. are you, are you really push saying button, uh -huh. you know? sometimes? Like the two of you would need a button that lasts longer than 15 <laughs> seconds.